What is the status of the neighbors? <laughs> we actually will be reshooting again. We have a pilot 22 minutes. Long story short, I said this today already, but I will repeat one more time. <laughs> and after tomorrow, I'll repeat one more time. And when I sleep and my ghost go to Bay Area, it, it will repeat one more time. <laughs> we got to approve one episode I'm against because I want to do like at least five episodes. But the good news is that we uh, probably before February, we'll be releasing ourselves or with Big Sharks. You know what I'm talking about. Does everybody know what The Neighbors is? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yep. The Neighbors, from the mind of the rest of the room, there is a full-length pilot for a TV series coming out by Tomo called The Neighbors. And it's incredible if you can find the trailer online, I believe, on your website. Right. And you can pitch into this owner here that maybe he decided to, to, to as a courtesy of Wazel Films, to actually show him the pilot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. But, Woo! Woo! <laughs> it's up to them, you know, they are so nice right now, but never mind. You know. <laughs> <laughs> next next question over there in the corner. You see, he tried to ignore the question. You know. <laughs> actually, my response, but that's okay. I don't know, you see, you're rushing me now. <laughs> More questions now. Right. Yes, so, sorry guys. So, so in the movie, um, when Mark and Lisa make love, uh, it's kind of a sinister act, an act of infidelity, but the music... I haven't seen the movie yet! Spoiler <laughs> <laughs> <Order> alert! <laughs> yeah, we already have an interaction, that's great. Right. Oh, it remains romantic, <laughs> but why is it not something more sinister? Well, let me ask you, are you referring to me or referring to to question to Greg, because I'm confused right now. I mean, who tried the music? Did Greg choose the music? <laughs> subliminal thing on the part of the art direction. Would it be a red? What? Yeah, the, the use of the color red uh, sprinkled throughout the film, and I'm wondering if that was a conscious decision. <laughs> Say it again. I mean, <laughs> I mean specific, specific. Well, in terms of her dress and the rose, and there's a lot of red used right, throughout, and right, I'm wondering. Right, right, right. Yeah. Right. Well, let me say it this way. Are you blind? <laughs> What do you think red represents? Red color. Forget the the, the, the room. Yes. Love. Love. What else?
What does the R in Chris R mean? <laughs> What's that for? R? Yep. The R. Well, you, he's, you, let's assume we don't have R here, we're not asking the question. I rest my question, uh, rest my answer. Move on, next question. Next question. <laughs> yes. Absolutely, no problem. <laughs> What exactly was Lisa's job? <laughs> job? Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, Let me tell you this. Like, educate yourself. Uh, one suggestion I have for you, look at the dictionary and look at the relationship. Next question. <laughs> this, educate yourself. Who's the fan of the room? Who's the fan of the room here? <laughs> Can you respond to his uh, stupid question? Computer in his cell. He's scared. Well, I'm not going to say that. Yes? Yeah, who? What? He's an American with an accent. What's wrong with that? Yeah, exactly. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I thought, yeah. Good. Yes. Yes. I was wondering how, how did you start White Oak Films? How did you get into film? That's a good question. That's a good question. You know, I actually believe that I, I, I was living here as well as I always been dedicated to some kind of art. I should be want to be a rock star, you know. But never mind about that. I sing actually. But we're not singing today. Do you think no. you're not? So, you know, I like entertainment, I like people. So, by the way, let me also, the guy who asked him where I come from, let me try, let me educate you, sir. This is put that question. I'm an American. You don't like it? That's your problem. Let's move on to the, uh, your question right now. So, I always like, I like people. I like people loud. And that's why we have the room. The room is something special. And that's what we promote in the room. Oh, you get the groovy time. Forget what happened is on the street right now. Forget about, you know, politics, all this crap. Enjoy it yourself. Yeah. Everyone. Yeah. 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 One last question. One last question. <laughs> Over here. And it can be for Greg. If you have a question for Greg, I'm going to ask Greg a question. Well, he has a question for Greg. What do you question out here? Somebody say Greg. I have a question for Greg. Yes. yes. Um, in the shot where you're in the car and you answer Lisa's call, very busy. Phone? Say that again. When you're in the car and you pick up Lisa's call, is that a cordless phone? <laughs> it's a 1970s cell phone. <laughs> No, Tommy and Frank will be in the Red Vic movie house after the screening. Happy to, to take some more pictures, and if you want to buy more stuff, get a sign. Sing us out! So maybe they'll sing us out. Yeah. 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 Uh, I will tell you this, that you have choices. Shakespeare or uh, singing. Which one you prefer? Sing! Sing! We'll do a go. We'll do a go. Sing! I'll take it. Okay. Shakespeare, raise your hand. Shakespeare. Okay, Shakespeare. We'll take Shakespeare.